would you define resilience? It's a subset of sustainability. And it's about what? Adaptability. It's about the ability to change. The inability to change as I think and adapt, I think is one of the biggest problems we've ever faced in the world. How governments and institutions prevent change, prevent peaceful and appropriate change to occur. And to me, this is where it fits into the resilience point is that resilience is recognition that you, that you have to change at some point. Okay. Talk about these questions in my class. How do we adapt to this new environment you know, that we're in? And so far, the United States is not adapting well. What obligations we owe to future generations? And I thought it was a really fascinating discussion that more or less has dropped off the table. No one talks about what's the world we're going to, le to leave to your grandchildren or your great-grandchildren, et cetera, et cetera. We seem to have forgotten all that. Uh, and I say that because part of me wants to be optimistic and say that your generation is going to be smarter than mine in terms of how to address you know, some of these major problems that, that, uh, that we're facing. But I worry sometimes and wonder if we've already crossed the tipping point. You know, if when it comes to, let's say, climate change, and things like that, are we already at that point of no return? I want to hope not. And, um, but I just don't know. You know, you know, I, you know, you see the numbers. I see the numbers uh, in terms of what's happening. And there's days that I get incredibly scared about this and say, you know, you know, I almost want to say I'm almost glad I'm not going to be here in 100 years because I think it's going to be really ugly. Some of it is 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 human nature, fear of change, resistance to change. A lot of it is po is political. The um, we've got a lot of people who are just scared of of this. We've got at least one one political party uh, that views this as a threat to their base. A lot of it is just lack of will. Lack of will and a lack of the political incentives to make the change.